Hello, hello, and welcome back once again to Sapienza and the Landslide Missions. And today we are going to take care of the How About a Magic Trick Redapted Challenge, which entails us basically killing Marco with a pep. Uh, with this we will also get the Above the Law Discovery of Feet, I Object Discovery of Feet, and Driving Off into the Sunset discovery or feat or both or whatever you want to call it so right off the bat from the start we are going to make our way towards the town hall you may have noticed I have brought with me the make you sick dart gun because on the original game we used to be able to just go and turn off a fuse box and distract someone but now they've sort of moved the other guy's position and he is now the one to spot you and you can only distract one of them so once we get up to the main plaza area up the main road there we're going to head to the toilets that are under the town hall building and we're going to wait for this guard who's just walking past us here to leave and when he does we're going to pull out our make you sick dart gun and we're going to shoot that guy in front of the mirror and then put the gun away very quickly. We will then use the fuse box I previously mentioned to distract the other guy. So, one is going to go to the toilet cubicle to be sick, and the other is going to go and investigate the fuse box. So we can now lockpick this toilet door, make our way inside, close doing? the door behind you, us. You gotta leave right now. now we need okay, to please? get behind the lawyer and knock him out. It's easier said than done in some cases because he does tend to sort of turn to face you most of the time. But once he's unconscious, we're going to dump him in the crate here and we're going to take his outfit. We are also going to drop our make you sick gun in this room somewhere after I've reloaded it for no apparent reason. So we're just going to drop that there and we're going to leave the room and the building itself. So we want to go now and make our way to the clock tower door for the town hall, which is just to our right. There's two guards guarding the door. We're going to speak to them. Well, look who we have here. Ciao, Rob Momo. We've been looking for you. See, the boss wants to talk to you. So why don't we go inside? We'll be here shortly. So let's step inside. Aviati will be expecting you in your office. I hope you're not armed. So they're going to open the door for us because it is locked hey, nice breads, buddy. and we're just going to run ahead of them up the stairs. We are going to make our way all the way up to the top to the room where we would normally take out the surveillance system uh, where we were taking out the surveillance system quite a lot during the Icon mission. Uh, there is a guard in here so we're going to knock him out shouldn't be smoking indoors and on the job so we're going to take out the surveillance system and then we're going to make our way back downstairs one floor and we're going to go and wait for Marco to arrive and we're going to wait on a couch and when Marco arrives someone will come through that double doors in front of us and then they will frisk us hence dropping the gun earlier and we will go in and Im immediately we want to blend in there are two blending spots there's a red chair and there's a model boat on the right we're gonna go and sit in the chair because Marco is an enforcer to this outfit so we need to be blending in before he turns around and faces us basically and then we'll go through our little conversation piece he will then dismiss all of his guards and when he has his back to us at the desk we can make our move so I can just see on the mini map that Marco is now making his way into the building so I think he's got like two flights of stairs to go up and a corridor to make his way down So he's up the stairs, he's now making his way down the corridor. 
and he's now into the town hall office. So any second now these doors will open and someone will come to fetch us. Here he comes now. Mr. Abiati can see you now. So we're going to stand up and get frisked. Sir, if you want to proceed, I'm going to have to do a quick routine check. And you can see just he over looks, the guard's shoulder, okay, there is, is the red out. chair that we are actually going to go and sit in. And just to the right out of sight is a Green model light. boat that go we ahead, could sir. also blend in with. Get out of the way, mate. Nice and there is Marco. Well. So we're going to sit down, can blend in, so that he doesn't see through our disguise. Well, <laughs> everything is relative, right? Now, I hear that you love our fair town as much as I do, and that makes me happy. We elite need to stick together, build a better world, wouldn't you say? People talk too much. So, are we gonna do this? Whoa, whoa, slow down, amigo. I'm just here to talk. I apologize for the men outside, but I'm very high profile and need protection. We don't need to be enemies. We can become friends. Keep talking. You clearly are a man who knows how to cut through the crap. So he's going to dismiss all the guards now. Don't let anyone in, you hear? That's a Roger, sir. Bravo, Amo. Let me speak frankly. That's what I do, and that is why the people. So love when he turns his back to us, we'll be able to get up and go over to it. Can put me in an awkward situation, an unnecessarily awkward situation. For you see, I'm only interested in what is best for this town. And kill him with the pen. Target down. Now head towards an exit. So we're going to quickly grab his body and hide him in the crate over here. I'll pass. So there you go, that will be the, or that will get you the How About a what Magic the? Trick Redacted Challenge. All we've got to do now is make our way to an exit, which I am not going to do directly. There is one exit we have not yet explored, and that will be the car exit. So what we're going to do is we're going to come over back to the toilets and just outside the toilets at the bin we will find some rat poison. We're now going to make our way round to the back of the town hall and down into the basement of the ice cream parlour. We're going to have to lockpick this door and in here we will find a waiter and a bodyguard. There's the bodyguard just arriving now and there's the waiter. So we're going to wait for the waiter to leave and the bodyguard will stop where he is now and he will play with his phone with his back to us. So all we need to do now is wait for the waiter to leave the area. We're going to dive through this door, we're going to knock out the bodyguard and hide his body, pick up his gun and then we're going to wait for the waiter to come back and we're going to knock out the waiter, hide his body and take his outfit. So the waiter is now just leaving, so we're going to lockpick this door. Make our way inside, knock out the bodyguard. Grab his gun, grab his body, hide him in the cupboard in the corner. And then now, all we've got to do is wait for the waiter to come back. So we're just going to stand behind this pillow here. Or pillar, not pillow. As you can see, the waiter is returning now. He is also an enforcer because we are trespassing. So once he walks into the room and past this post, we're going to make our way around the back of it. Sneak up behind him. And we're going to knock him out. And we're going to hide his body also in a closet or a crate or something like that. And we're going to take his outfit. It just makes the next section of this a little bit easier. 
Remember, none of this, you, you don't have to do any of this. This is just to get the driving into the sunset challenge, discovery feat, whatever it is. So once we have the waiter's outfit, we're going to make our way back round to the market area. And we need to keep an eye out for the other waiter, the one in red. You can just see him over by that market stall. He's also an enforcer. So we need to be quite cautious around him. As you can see, once he's walked over to the left side of the stall, we're able to go in and round to the right. We're going to use the rat poison we picked up on the bottle in the centre here and we're going to run to the toilets. You have to time that quite well because you only have a couple of seconds to get in there and deliver the poison. So all we've got to do now is wait for the uh, waiter to take from his drink, get sick and make his way over here, which he is doing now. He's going to make his way into the toilets and we're just going to follow him in, knock him out and take the car keys. There you go, we're just going to hide his body just for the sake of being neat and tidy. Grab the car keys. We're going to exit the cubicle, make our way into the cubicle next door and put on our suit. Or in this case, our clown's outfit. And we are now good to go. So, as long as we don't go up that way, that's it. We make our way out to where the old VW Beetle used to be. And that one isn't there anymore, but there is another one. Slightly further down the road. And slightly more pink. So there you go, that's the How About a Magic Trick Redacted Challenge completed. Work, I have been Anubis, and I will see you all in the next video.